late eyewitness news. Weekend edition in high definition. Dozens of people are giving up their weekend to walk the strip. It's called the Endurance Challenge, and it's been done around the world, but Las Vegas is inspiring walkers like never before. Eyewitness News reporter Amanda Hernandez explains why outlasting the rest will benefit charities. 24-7, these feet are going, and after a day of walking up and down the strip, or about 50 miles, bodies are starting to wear out. My feet hurt, <laughs> but I don't know. I still have energy. I'm not tired at all, but just the feet hurt. These walkers are competing to be the last one walking. The only catch, you don't get to stop. 24-7, non-sleep. We eat on the run, and we grab food. We stop for our bathroom pit. It's physically challenging and it's also mind, you know, your mind plays a strong role, this one. There is no end to this race, so you keep going. With previous races across the world, some previous walkathon winners call Vegas a great setting. So many more different things to see here. It's really interesting. Keeps you awake during the nighttime. Winning a race in his native Berlin, Mark says he wanted to compete again, hoping the event would go longer this time. Oh, I figured that was not enough for Berlin, so I came to Vegas now to try to go maybe two or three days. Beyond just bragging rights, these walkers are also earning money for their favorite charities. For every mile they walk, one dollar is given to their selected charity. And that was Amanda Hernandez reporting. We're told the race finished about 10 minutes ago. Apparently there are two winners. The remaining two walkers agreed to stop walking at the same time. I think maybe they were a little tired. They walked for a total of 31 hours. And you heard that sound bite from that gentleman. Las Vegas, you know, they walk all night. Mm -hmm. What's well, great because in Las Vegas, everyone else is up at night too. Yeah, but I, I, did you see them taking up that escalator? I don't know if that constitutes as walking. That was a nice what little break for so them. Tough. I 31 don't know. hours? Yeah, I guess you're right. The only thing they, they do is stop and go to the bathroom. All right, and ride escalators. Yeah, I'm glad you're not the <laughs> judge. <laughs> yeah.